Greetings, dear viewers! I'm Quill Quickcard, and welcome back to Super Mario All-Stars, specifically Super Mario Bros. 2. It is time for level 2, and we're going in with Toad. Mario is the most uh, balanced and... Oof. It, I, I can't go diagonal. Why, why could I not go diagonal? Hold on. Okay, that might solve it. Let's find out. Is this why I was having so much trouble? Was this the missing link I was never able to solve? Was it just because my diagonals were non-functional? I'm gonna be honest, I really don't like if that's what, what I really don't like if that's what's happened. Alright, here is another enemy, the uh ninji. Oh, okay, need a key. Alright, here is our first key of Mario Brothers 2. This is going to be a regular recurring feature where I have to find keys and get chased. Oh, freaking hell. Okay. Boink! So, Toad is the fastest of the uh, Mario characters. Um. Oh. Wow, they respawn quick. Um, so Toad is the fastest, and he also picks up items the fastest. Ugh, you little ass. Whoop, okay. That's not a bomb. We need bombs. Thank you. There we go. Alright, that's a path. Every character has different advantages and disadvantages over each other. Okay. Can I kill Birdo if I'm in star mode? Ah. Well, I didn't get the chance to find out. Of all the characters, uh, Princess Peach is the slowest to pick things up. Uh, Luigi is the second slowest, and then it's Mario is just a little bit slower than Toad. And then if you grab coins by picking up plants um, that you see inside of the areas that you generate by throwing those potions on the ground, you get coins. And then the coins can be used in this bonus game to try and earn extra lives. There's a lot of actually really fun mechanics. Oh. Okay, okay. Two extra lives. I'll take it. All right, what do we start? Okay, we start with a we start with a sniffet. The shy guys are the ones that don't spit. Sniffets do spit. All right. Next character we're going to show off, now we're going to have Luigi. Luigi has the highest jumps in the game, by far. And, in fact, uh, if you do a charge jump with Luigi, it's the best jump in the game. There are entire sections you can clear um, with Luigi by doing charge jumps. That charge, that brings a star. Okay. Every five cherries will cause a star to spawn. Whoop. Yeah, the American Super Mario Brothers 2 really is just a completely different animal than any other Mario game. Which, you know, makes a lot of sense, because it wasn't a Mario game. It was a reskin of a completely unrelated game. 
Well, thanks, Luigi. That was... Oh, you ass. Oh, no. D um, no. Uh, this game also has warp zones. Specifically, these are done by going into... Uh, specific... Uh... Specific pots like these while under the effect of a potion. Okay, good. They don't have collision. Damn it. So normally I would need to make a pile with those uh, mushroom blocks in order to get up here. But Luigi doesn't need to worry about that. Gonna wait till it passes. Okay. There we go. Just that simple. And now things get a bit harder. Because now I am being chased by Phanto as I try to work my way down the tower. And if I had to guess, I would say it was probably this mechanic that helped to inspire the sun in Mario Brothers 3. But if I just dropped a key, then Phanto stops chasing me. No! That's my first death. Yeah, you know what? We'll, we'll stick with Luigi. I think it just puts me in the same room. Yeah. Mario Brothers 2 is actually quite forgiving, which is a hell of a nice change after Lost Levels. Whew. But that's not to say that this game also doesn't get really hard toward the end. Because it absolutely does. Okay? Whew. But, for the most part, the controls are nice and responsive. It, it's just a feel-good experience, honestly. I have so much aerial control. Uh, no Birdo here. Just in a word. Goodbye, Ninji. Alright. Specifically, no Birdo, because there's gonna be a different boss. Nope, nope, you go there. Okay. Let's get him. Alright. Okay. So, I have to throw this mouse's bombs back at them, which is quite a bit harder than it seems. The hitboxes on the bombs are not great, but luckily the explosions do linger a bit, making it absolutely possible to defeat these guys. All right, we're just gonna go three quick taps. Well, that didn't do anything. And finally, Princess Peach, uh, who many might consider to be the strongest character in this game. Princess Peach has the ability to jump and hover. And this is an ability that has basically just since become just associated with Peach. This is just... These days, this is just the way that Peach operates. But this was the game that did it first. And it really is a powerful ability. I mean, my god. But the price for that is that she's slower, she doesn't jump as high, and she takes the longest time to pick up objects. 
which can make digging kind of annoying. Whoop. Oh. Just being chased. Okay. Alright, there's a star. Alright. Alright, let's just dig, 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 dig. While I'm invincible. Okay, go that way. And dig, dig, dig. Diggy, diggy holes. And down we go. Perfect. This is probably one of the best reskinned games of all time, honestly. The the fact it was reskinned so effectively into a Mario game when it originally had nothing to do with Mario is genuinely exceptional and impressive. And all the more so considering that many of the things that came from this reskin have since become beloved parts of the Mario universe. Come on... Ah, you little jerk. Boing! Alright, what do we got? What do we got? Okay, a seven. Nope, that doesn't help. Well, I gave it my best shot. Uh, we're gonna go with Peach again. I, I will try to mix it up a lot between the different characters. Instead of just, you know, picking one and then ending the entire game with that one. There we go. So, this is... Uh, this is going to be what I mean. So, when you have a potion, some of these pots you're able to go down. And this is how you do warping in this game. And, yeah, it, it actually... Ugh, God. It's actually really cool how well hidden they are. Anything useful down here? Well, I got to kill a guy. That's kind of cool. No, 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 Pete, Pete, damn it! Mm. Oh, you little jerk. It has been so many years since I last played this game. So you really want to optimize those potions in order to increase your gains. You want to use them in places where you haven't already grabbed all the veggies, ouch, and where you haven't already grabbed all the cherries, because then you're able to get more from more out of them. Holy crap, dude. Okay, one up. Hell yeah. Oh, oh god. Um, all right, jump. Bomb. What is over here? Screw you. Jeez, you ass. Please. Oh my god, I can't believe I did that. Ooh, hey, health. You ass. Okay, stop. Stop. Alright, gotta be careful because enemies do respawn. Alright, let's go. Oh boy. Nope. Go that way. Okay. Keep going. Keep going. No, no, no. 
Oh boy. Um. Okay, okay, okay. They're they're all down there. Just, just, just go. Just go. Get get out of my way. At least I don't have to deal with a time limit. All right, I think that's good for a star, right? All right, let's go. Go, go, go. Just keep digging. Keep digging, Peach. I believe... Damn it. Well... Oh, no. One of these guys... Oh, crap. Um... Nope. Okay, okay. Alright, we're down. Alright, another Birdo area. This time we have a red Birdo. So, the mushroom blocks I have to keep using. Later Birdos will sometimes not throw uh, throwable bullets at all. They will only throw fireballs. Peach is great for getting around the levels, but against the bosses, her slow pickup speed really can be a liability. Okay. And... nothing there. I predict that I will win nothing. I'm not actually good at that. Uh, yeah, Mario! It's Mario time again. Okay, 2-3. It also helps that worlds in this game are only three levels long as opposed to four. No freaking you little ass jerk bastard. Okay. So, I want somewhere with multiple cherries and veggies on screen. Okay. Ah. Whoop. Okay. When you pick up five veggies in a row, you're able to stop time. There really are just a lot of really cool little things in this game. Oh my, just, just go, just go. No. Okay. Kill the enemies. Oh my god. I missed the heart. Oh, that makes me sad. Okay. <sighs> Alright. Can I get that star? Alright, yes I can. I'm going to bet left side for where I want to go. Just looking for another key. Okay, here's the key room. Jeez, that, that Sparky nearly killed me. Drop the key to keep safe. Alright, let's go, let's go, let's go. Almost to the door. Success. Oh! I have a hitbox above my body. 
I do not know my hitboxes and my physics quite as well for this game as I do for other classic Marios. <laughs> Screw you guys. Okay. Alright, boss time? Alright, what's the boss? This freaking hell, it's a goddamn three headed fire breathing dragon. Okay, okay, fair enough. Three headed fire breathing dragon, got it. Oh my god. Okay, that's fine! Oh! Damn, he's hard. All right, we're we're going to go for speed. Okay, that's good. Okay. Oh. All right, retreat, go in. And that is the boss of World 2 defeated. Let's continue. But first, can I get any extra lives? Ooh. Yes, I can. Well, isn't that nice? Uh, we're gonna go for Luigi again. Oh, I think I remember this level. This one's a classic. And it's so pretty, too. This game really just looks so damn good in Mario All-Stars. I mean, they, they all do, honestly, but I think this one, I think this one especially is just an absolute work of art in this version. Okay. Climb, Luigi, climb! Wiggle your little plumber butt! Okay. Ah! F I really thought those were platforms. It turns out they were not, in fact, platforms. I'm not going for those. Just going to kill the plant and move on with my life. Nice and peaceful. Okay. You know what? Screw those. I'm, I mean, I'm gonna be done with the level soon anyway. Alright, so what is the scenario? Mm. Alright, that's two hits. Freaking hell. Damn it! Ooh! I was so close that time, though. See, I I love this. It's still a challenge, but it's such a a fairer challenge than I was getting with with lost levels. Like, I don't feel bad when I, when I get my butt kicked here. Uh, Peach again. Why not? Peach again for 3-2. Whoa! Yep, that is a shy guy riding an ostrich. You know, just 
normal, everyday things. Uh, new plan. We're just gonna go over you. Hello, gentlemen. Oh, screw you. You ass. <laughs> you damn sniffets. Oh, thank God. Alright, that's... That's good for two coins. I can't remember exactly where I'm supposed to go in this level. Uh, this is probably the first, like, really... Th this is probably the first, like, real, uh, labyrinth level. And we will see more and more of this as the game progresses. Uh, levels which are really... Which are really difficult due to their maze qualities more than anything else. I don't know if I can actually make that, but I did. I did. I did make that. Oh. Oh, screw you, little buddies. Oh. Ho, ho. Thank you. And back down. back up, and over, and down. Okay. Ow. Damn it. Crap. Alright. Last bomb. Damn. At least... It keeps track of what room I'm in. And at least I keep my maximum health. Okay, that's good enough. Uh, what's over here? Ooh. Well, hello, hello. Ah, see, if I had broken specifically this this area over here first, I would have been able to access that, uh, that health mushroom in the, uh, potion world. Alright, boss time. What do we got? Damn it. Whoop. Nope, you're gonna die. Ah. Don't mind me. There you go, you always do three in a row and then a jump. But I've learned your secrets, Birdo. Got a lot of coins for this level. I'm not especially good at this, so I'm just gonna click through it, and if I'm lucky enough to win a life, I win a life. Alright, there's one extra life since I started with a cherry. Uh, how... How am I on time? I'm at, what, 30 minutes or so for the episode? Alright, one more level or one more life, whichever comes first. I think this is one... Where... No... Okay, grab... All right, we got some extra health now. Free, no. 
Alright, there is definitely going to be uh, a key to find in here. No doubt about it. Another coin. Damn ninjas. Okay. Does this way lead to the key? There are multiple paths, I see. So, shy guys can change direction. And red sniffets can fall down. Ooh. Okay. So, I'm going to take that to mean that I need to go through the upper door to get the key, but I can fall down further in order to help shortcut back to the lock. Oh. oh. Okay. Enemy spawners. Interesting. Luckily, Luigi can handle all of these jumps. Good job, Luigi. Oh boy. Right. Let's go. Oh boy. Okay, I I seem to be confusing him by just continuing to change direction. Still, no reason to give him more opportunities to catch me. Freaking hell. All right, go, 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 go. You know? I'm quite proud of how I'm doing. Oh. I had not actually seen that that would hit me. And drop. They really do make this a challenge. So, what's in here? Okay. So, this is the upper door I saw from below, but was unable to reach. So, I'm going to assume that this leads to another key. For oh! I mean, I feel like I'm pretty close to already beating the level at this point, so... Honestly, why not just go for the finish? Whoop. And then I'd be able to start the next episode fresh on World 4. It would be nice for everybody. Okay. Nope. No, we're not dealing with you. Oh my god. Oh my god, there's so many things. There's so many things here. No, 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 no. Oh, you ass. Damn it. Oh, that sucks. Okay, I I did get big again, though, so that's a plus. I th These things are going to be the bane of the entire playthrough. Alright, there's the star. Wait for it. 
damn it. Is the star still there? No, it despawned. Okay, of course it did. Alright, are you where there's another key? Okay, no you are not. You're just... some other place. Some of the levels really do just... feel like they branch. Alright, so who is our enemy this time? Alright, it's another Mauser. Frank! No! Alright, we're gonna have to go Toad again. I can do this. I can finish World 3 today. Oh. Oh! I can just catch him mid-air? Cool. I didn't remember that being a feature. Whoops. All right, that should hit for sure. All right, that's gonna land right on my head. And I also, just from that, learned that the bombs can take out the Sparkies. That is extremely valuable information. No freaking hell. Okay, that might hit. Close. Got him. Oh! Okay, he's not dead yet. Alright, that should hit. You take a surprising number of hits to kill. This is, a, uh, this is actually a really good boss. Alright, got him. Whew! Another success. I'm losing a lot of lives quickly now. Alright! Well, I think that went fantastic. But that's all I'm going to do for now, and I will see you all on the next one.